astronomers have discovered what appears to be a tiny star with a giant, cloudy storm, using data from NASA's Spitzer and Kepler space telescopes. The dark storm is akin to Jupiter's great red spot, a persistent, raging storm larger than Earth. The star is the size of Jupiter, and its storm is the size of Jupiter's great red spot, said John Geises of the University of Delaware, Newark. We know this newfound storm has lasted at least two years, and probably longer. Geises is the lead author of a new study appearing in the Astrophysical Journal. While planets have been known to have cloudy storms, this is the best evidence yet for a star that has one. The star, referred to as W1906 plus 40, belongs to a thermally cool class of objects called L-dwarfs. Some L-dwarfs are considered stars because they fuse atoms and generate light, as our sun does, while others, called brown dwarfs, are known as failed stars for their lack of atomic fusion. The L-dwarf in the study, W1906 plus 40, is thought to be a star based on estimates of its age, the older the L-dwarf, the more likely it is a star. Its temperature is about 3,500 degrees Fahrenheit, 2,200 Kelvin. That may sound scorching hot, but as far as stars go, it is relatively cool. Cool enough, in fact, for clouds to form in its atmosphere. Follow-up observations with Spitzer, which detects infrared light, revealed that the dark patch was not a magnetic star spot but a colossal, cloudy storm with a diameter that could hold three Earths. The storm rotates around the star about every nine hours. Spitzer's infrared measurements at two infrared wavelengths probe different layers of the atmosphere and, together with the Kepler visible light data, helped reveal the presence of the storm. While this storm looks different when viewed at various wavelengths, astronomers say that if we could somehow travel there in a starship, it would look like a dark mark near the polar top of the star. The researchers plan to look for other stormy stars and brown dwarfs using Spitzer and Kepler in the future.